hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna do a makeup look with minimum brushes and minimum sponges so in case if you don't have a lot of brushes you can also work with your hands with your fingers and uh, with the things that are available around you you don't need expensive brushes to do makeup so i've already prepped my skin i'm starting with my eye base i've put the concealer now i'm setting it with the loose powder since i didn't have a powder brush available i was using a cotton to set my eyes and that works fine so now i'm starting with my eye makeup again i'm using my james charles palette and uh, since my dress has a little blue and pink i'll go in with this blue so first i'm starting with a lighter shade taking a little warm brown so the next shade i'm using is the blue and since I don't have another eye brush available, I'm applying with my fingers. That's how you can do it too, if you don't have brushes available. So I'm using my LA Pro Girl Concealer again for my under eyes and also to hide my darkness, my pimple marks, everything. So I'm using my fingers to blend it all in since my brushes are not available. I'm using the L'Oreal True Match Foundation. So finally found a sponge so I'm putting applying my foundation with the sponge if you don't even have a sponge available you can of course use your fingers and blend it. After applying the foundation, make sure you set the eyes first because the crease the most. So I'm using the same beauty blender and setting my eyes. Now I'm using the Elana cheek tint. Really like the product. As you can see, I'm not using any brushes. I'm blending it with my fingers. You can do the same. You don't need a lot of brushes. A little on my nose. The next I'm using is Nika Strobe and Glow. It gives a really nice glow. So I'm using the cotton again to set my entire face since I don't have a powder brush. Using my Anesthesia Bro Pomade to do my eyebrows. Now I'm using my Forever 52 highlighter palette to highlight my cheekbones, my brow bone and I'll also highlight the bridge of my nose. So I'll be using a Q-tip to highlight the inner corners of my eye. Now I'm using a white kajal to put it in my waterline. 
that gives your eyes a little extra definition and makes it look bigger so i'll be using the same q-tip and applying the blue eyeshadow under my waterline So now it's the mascara time. I'm using the L'Oreal Lash Paradise for my mascara. For the lip liner, I'm using my Miss Claire lip liner. They are really good and really affordable. So I've topped my lip liner with a lip gloss. So since I have a little oily skin, I'm using the NYX uh, Matte Finish Setting Spray to set my face. And that's it. I'm done with my makeup look. Hope you liked it. If you all did like it, do like, share, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye.